you saw with that little bit in the beginning, we have a new member of the team. But first, in the last episode, we came here to Pony Island. We basically did a little bit of exploring. Hoppa became the new Kahuna, and we're about to go to the altar of or altar of the sun or something like that. Anyways, not important. We're going to get something. But I want to show you our new team member. So I ended up catching a Gramble. You know that. I was that was in the episode. Uh, it had an animal nature, and I ended up. I just bred five Snubble off. With my perfect ditto I had, and I just decided, just in case one of them is decent. So, and then I ended up treating the, uh, the Gramble for the Sushelos. And then I I gave it a rare candy, and it leveled up, and became, uh, Sol, Sol the, uh, Gastrodon. I don't really know how to pronounce it. If it's Soleil, or Sol. I gave her Bulldoze, uh, because she didn't have any ground-type moves. She had a very decent move set. She had written, like, oh, let's see... Body Slam is the only one that I kept from when it was uh, a Shellos. Muddy Water, uh, Body Slam, Rain Dance, and something else. So anyways, it's got Storm Drain, which boosts special attack when hit by a water type move. It came with the Waterium Z, and I didn't end up taking it off it. Because, why not? It'll work. I gave it Sludge Wave, Scald, and Bulldoze. And yeah, it's got a Quiet Nature too. It's probably got some decent IVs, considering uh, it had a Quiet Nature, which is... It's, it's an okay nature for a Gastrodon. Uh, especially, I play through a cut. I am so yawny today. Anyway, did you find anything useful, dude? Yes, and Hapu was meeting the new Kahuna. Oh, little Hapu? We have an old man Nanu look out for grand trials until now. Ah, we got our own little Kahuna. That's great. Yeah, Hapu will do best for late grandfather. Must do my best for my mother's sake and for Nebby as well. And so, this place we need to go uh, Executor Island. You think it's like, oh, I know where the food is, right. In that case, I better get to the chief. Did you call me? Is that going to be the veteran? Yep. Oh my goodness. Nice to meet you. I'm chief of the Seafolk. Couldn't help overhearing what you said with someone. I'll get you to Executor Island. Executor. Oh, little lady. Till you should go. Uh, she's a trainer after all. Executor, Executor is a pretty crazy place. That's true, there's some crazy critters. One thing, but you're not a trainer, she just trusts your friend to take care of this task. But, Olivia, I've got this. You're right, I'm sure you can lob and you can handle better than anyone else. I'll wait for you to come back. I'll wait for Lily, I'll make you model for a picture, Lily. So we're not going with Lily this time, which is great. Oh wow, they did do a lot. I could be wrong, and it just could have been like this from before. With a few changes. Anyway, there's the moon flute. Alright, I get it. Remember! Please remember! Remember what I used to be! Ha, here we are at Executor Island. I heard this place used to be trial site, though that was a long time ago now. Looks like the fellow's even more worried up and worked up than usual. Well, there always a noisy bunch. Probably fine. You go on. Good luck. <laughs> My best bet to take these guys on would have been Araquanid with the uh, Ice Beam, but I don't know what I really want to do. Do I have to fight them, or can I just go past them? I guess I have to fight them, because... The pathway up here is blocked. Oh, I found a big pearl here. Sweet. All right, we're gonna let Raichu take care of this rowdy bunch. He's acting a bit off. Cause that's a pincer. I heard pincers cry. So was this pincer on it? Was that how how things went? All right, one pincer down. They're all gonna be pincer then. That makes sense. Pincer number two goes down. And paralyzed hacks goes to level 45, mate. I'm gonna help you out, buddy. And number three has been defeated. Sweet.
Okay. You gonna clear the brush for me? Oh, it lifted you up. Thank you, bud. That's 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 pretty neat. All right, that's 93 stickers. Sweet. I'm gonna hop off now. There is a fl the moon flute. I'm gonna look around, and make sure I'm not gonna miss any stickers, cause I don't know the next time I'll ever come. I'll come back. So let's get me the moon flute. Will you take the flute? I will take the flute. I was hoping there'd be a cutscene of me picking it up. As soon as I took the moon flute, the rain cleared, cause that. That makes sense. I'm back. I got it. Welcome back, Lilia. Now you get to play this foots up at the altar, I guess. Altar being found in the deepest part of the vast Pony Canyon. I think it should take a liking to you. You got something important in you as a trainer. Pokemon like you that much. <laughs> and he's gonna laugh because that's really funny. Apparently. Anyway. Alright, I'm gonna go heal up, and then we'll go... We're gonna fight What's-Her-Face. I already forgot her name. I don't know why. But you know who I'm talking about. Hapu. Alright, first up as we go through here... I mean, if it's the same as last time, we're fighting Plumeria. Maybe get the Poisonium Z. You're from Team Skull. What is it you want from us? Here they come. What about new dumb skulls at Aether? Do you really know how to open an ultra room and say our boy Guzma? Let me see if you're bad boy, bad to the bone enough to save our boy Guzma. Oh my gosh, you have an Ekans. I let out with Java because of her having Bulldoze, but I didn't even need to lead Java. I mean, obviously, uh, this is I could have taken him down. But, you know. You're gonna coil. Okay. And Ekans goes down. Oh, yeah. Sweet. Oh, that hurts. Even my heart hurts. Okay. Might want to get that looked at. Did you see the little clip, that little bit of animation where, like, I don't know. She was in her crouching pose and then it just immediately popped up through her standing pose? I don't know. Oh, no, Bones Bad. You were stronger than me. You had one Ekans. Doesn't matter. I'll come after you with all Pokemon at once. We'll get 500% to save a boy Guzma. So I th I'm taking on one grunt with five Pokemon, right? Because they got rid of the Horde battles. Oh yeah, I forgot I gave Java Fire Blast. I did Count King. I put a little text bubble thing. But Flamethrower for... Um, for Incineroar would do more damage. Just because of the base power difference. I ended up... I calc Because I randomly just put in Lopini. Because I think it was Count King... Lopini's speed, uh, and I had left that in there, and I just calced Incineroar and against it, and uh, Lopini is way better special defense, and even then, it was still very close, which would do more. So, I'll keep battling, because Java can take out his squad pretty simply. Let's see, do I outspeed? Good. Okay. I made a mistake in not actually going up to Brick Break. I thought, for some reason, I was still on Boldo, so I could just go down and go up to it. Whatever. Anyway, next up is a Marini. Oh, good job, Java. She expelled her own poison. Sweet. All right, we'll just go for one more bulldoze and take down the Marini. Next, we have a Golbat. Is that our? That's not our last Pokemon. Um, uh, what do I got on this guy? I'll stay in and fire blast it. I think we can do decent. Actually, Darkest Lariat is probably a better idea because Darkest Lariat really can't miss. I don't think it actually can, unless it would have an invasion boost or like a bright powder, you know. Not bad. I probably, I, I'm assuming that this Golbat was is going to be the best one they had, so I probably could have just gone for the the Z, the Z crystal. I don't even know if Brick Break will take it out. So I'm just going to go for Darkest Lariat, even though we have to sit through the animation again. And Java grows level 45. Alright, so what's your last Pokemon going to be? It's a Houndour. Okay. Whatever. I'll just stay in. No big deal. 
Brick Break should just take you out pretty simply. They're gonna go for Flamethrower. Ooh. Brick Break should... Okay, yeah. Hound Hour is pretty weak defensively. I don't know who the Mover Learner is. I believe it's up on Mount Lanakila, so... 5% is like what percentage of your strength? 50, maybe? Man, lost this Navio. Please save Guzma for us. You dummies. You're trying to save the boss. So what do you want to get in their way for? I was expecting Lily to say, Oh my goodness, at the bottom. <laughs> you girly. Lily, right? Damn it. You really, you really ready to do this finally? Honestly, I treat you really badly. You know, soon the work's present told me that I shouldn't have done all that. Even if I apologize now, it's probably going to be too late for you to forgive me, though. See, Guzma, he really likes the president. She's the only dude who ever seemed to see how strong he was. President, my mother is, she's selfish. She says all by herself what she thinks needs to be done to make other people happy, not caring for what it is they may want. Other people have to help one another out. That's what I've learned here in Alola. And so I'm going to teach her too. I think we can say Mr. Guma. Guzma. Guma. <laughs> you know, deep down, you're kind of like the president. Got in a different direction. I can tell you have the same strength in your convictions. Lily, Lily, I know you got no reason to help, but could you help us save Guzma? Well, we're going to... Lily's determined to save her mother, so we have to go there. <coughs> I'm dead inside. That big dummy, don't think he's aware of it, but Lola means a lot to him. That's why he's doing something so reckless to try to save it. Poison type Z crystal, maybe to help you ha somehow. Da -da 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 -da. I might give that to uh, Gastrodon a little bit later, so we can see acid downpour. I guess giving you Zico is all kind of what you call it, helping each other. Oh yeah, you got first turn directly from Tapakoka, didn't you, Lily? I keep it in the mic. I'm so sorry. Better take it. Take care of it. That's one special Z power ring. Trainer's only a trainer because the Pokemon with him. If you ever get that, bring the ra the top poop on yourself. You should be fine now. I'm out of here. Okay, peace nerd. That's fine. Heal me up, please. Suppose team skills not a bad. Here, let me thank your team. Sweet. Good, so I don't have to run back. I mean, even though it's not that far to Hapu's house, but whatever. Best Buddy Canyon lies ahead of us, indeed. Flamethrower is here. And I believe this is probably where Mina's trial is. The Avastoponi Canyon! I really like you can move while the camera's still panning. I'm going to save, just because. And I will use Gastrodon probably against the Mudsdale. That was perfect timing to save. Literally one more step and the cutscene started. It looks like Xerneas. Everything go well? Well, I... What? I do, I do have a little do everything for me yet again, but... Nothing wrong with that little piggy and survive on their own. They gotta help one another. Well, Lily hasn't done anything for us. So, that's the reason. Same program I do is from a grandfather used to say. <laughs> so, kind of years, it keeps a brilliant smile on Lily's face. And the permanent one because I'm dead inside. Please wait, Vegeta. God damn it. How do you approach unnoticed? Just use your own strength to overcome the trials before you, Vegeta. Perhaps we stop relying on others and take matters in our own hands. We want to do Pokemon Battle of Steps and we might resolve situations across them on our own. If I'm strong enough, we can do it. If I am only strong enough to defeat you. So am I fighting Soliera again, or am I actually... I, why not Fico? If Fico's the one I wanted to fight. Alright. Poipole versus Dissidui. Let's do it. Poipole's so cute. Its normal form is way better than its shiny. I don't know what Naga Naganadel, or however you pronounce it, shiny looks like. You're level 49. Oh my goodness. X special defense. That's okay. I don't have a single special move on this Pokemon. Nasty plot. Oh no. I could use a crit right now, Doctor Who. I'm gonna go for Sucker Punch in case it attacks this turn. You're gonna go for the Hyper Potion. Damn it, damn it, damn it. You're gonna go for Toxic. Yeah, you have like Toxic Venoshock. Nasty Plot. I don't know what else. That was a crit. Thank you, my dude. 
Hey, and thank you for shaking off the toxic. That means it's Venice Shock will do less. Oh, it has poison jab now. So why do you why did you go for nasty plot? You're dumb. Alright. This should knock it out. Good job, Decidueye. Proud of you, buddy. Almost kinda wish he didn't have to fight him. So that I could have uh saved him so he wasn't overleveled. Let's see if we try to potential my Pokemon at least a little bit. But you didn't do too much to my this is why you poisoned him twice and that's about it it's refresh cry sounds a lot like Rowlet's. this is outstanding you show much skill for drawing for the power of your pokemon yes people who have out of the pokemon against one another learn more about others after all okay and then cool is out and hapu you're from the beast world are you not how old is hapu supposed to be because legitimately our character's 11. I'm assuming Lily's a little bit older. But Hapu doesn't even reach my shoulder. She a little person? <laughs> uh, I think she said that. You know, nerd, if you get to a Pokemon being anybody damn to survive, and you send sort of trouble, get to come ahead wherever we can. Whatever I said. <laughs> I'll throw myself upon your generosity and spread around shortcomings, Vegeta. Please, when the cross becomes attack this world, will you fight it in our place? I kind of have to. Yes. They're not asking you to. She's asking me. Well, then, in the past, trying to sue that king, you find out the training's in place to come for training to be tough road. You have to pitch into Lily. You can never read trouble. Must and I will hasten to you. So, is Lily gonna follow me around and heal me up? I think you'll do all I can to help Lilia. If that's something that happens, that'd be really cool. So, do I even have to fight you? So, I guess I'm not gonna fight the trial for a while. And I wish Lily would have healed me up. Because the Sidgewai took some damage. Alright, before we go there, I'm going to go get this TM. I don't know which one this is, though. Wild Charge. I think Incineroar can learn that. I don't know why I thought I could. I thought it could. Best Kane in we'll find ahead. What a mysterious statue. You think it means something? Take this. Okay. Next, what I found beneath the paradise. When I'm ready to go, I'll come, I'll come up and catch up to you. When you're ready, you'll catch up to me. Thank you for healing me up, at least. I'm glad I didn't waste any medicines.
Pen letters can be made out of the stone monument. A headlight is taken around the trials. You need to walk on its trials to take, be able to take part on something. The second, the courage to defeat the totem will deny entry. Okay. No, Captain. You ready to challenge the trial? Yes. Listen to just how deathly quiet it is. Holy crap. We're going to put Paralyzed Hacks up first. Just because Paralyzed Hacks is a psychic type. And we'll be up against dragons and then eventually uh, dragon fighting. There's a TM in there. Whoa, forgot about that. Is that a Vibrava though? No. Okay, for some reason from the side it looked like a Vibrava. I'm sorry little buddy. Paralyzed Haxus, it's expecting me to come up with a great strategy. Psychic. Simplest, simplest option. I wish I had the Psychium Z. Dragon Claw, okay. I don't think anyone can learn it, but you know what? I might as well check in if Incineroar can. Or if... What's his name can? Yeah. I mean, if it's just... You attack with large claws, I think... I don't know. I feel like... Poke clawed Pokemon should be able to learn it. And there's a hakama -O. All right, now you're a fighting type, so... Wrecked. Paralyzed attack scores level 48. Very nice. So what I'm going to end up doing probably is paralyzing the comma O. Oh, what did you drop? A heart scale. That's actually amazing. It's really cool to drop heart scales. That makes a lot of sense, too. I'm giving Paralyzed Haxi Twisted Spoon mainly because uh, electricity won't do too much help in this. We'll just let, I think I'm going to let Raichu just solo it. I will take the Z Crystal. And Hakama O will appear behind me. Art, come on. Sound! <laughs> That's an interesting way to describe its cry. Now you get like a boost in every stat, don't you? Yep. Let's just see how much Psychic will do for reference. That's not even a crit! Oh my gosh, I love you, Paralyzed Axe! You're amazing! Caesar. Alright, I just... That's kind of interesting. Let's go for the Psychic again on Kamo'o. Like, Paralyzed Axe, if you could crit this thing and beat it, like, immediately, that'd be awesome. Bullet Punch. Um... Fuck you! Light screen? I did not even know that it could learn light screen. Burn it, please. Think for the soul. Sink. I don't know. I need. I want to revive Paralyzed Axe. This Paralyzed Axe is my best bet. It just works really nicely for this fight. Oh great! Of course he used Drain Punch. All right, I'm gonna send in Java and kill the Caesar. Actually, I don't know why I did that. I just gave him free health. I basically f killed him up all the way. I swear, if you don't outspeed the Caesar, I'm gonna be mad. Thank you. Okay, Caesar is down. Also, like how he fires the flamethrower from his belt. Well, never mind. He's just gonna call another ally. I just need the. Oh my god! I'm not. Come on. I'm gonna go over the malicious moon salt on the Noivern. If I get the. If I survive. Alright, do you have the Grass DMZ or the Ghost DMZ? Oh, I'm really glad I didn't give you the Grass DMZ. That's actually perfect. Because you can hit Kamo'o for neutral damage. With a really strong move, too. Please, just survive on one. Yeah, Light Screen War off, great, woo. Fuck this shit, bro. Paralyzed Axe, I need a, like, a monster crit from you right now. Well, I just need a crit, actually. Or special special D drop? Yes! Perfect timing. Okay. Hang in there, Paralyzed Axe. You got this, man. Or not! God, you make me want to freaking scream. Alright, we're gonna go for Normalium Z. 
Actually, why do I keep sending in the normal types? Again, I just fucking heal them all the way up. <sighs> Who fucking cares if he's in love? You literally can't. It doesn't matter because you're dead. Dude. This has been the worst freaking trial so far. Almost as bad as the Toka tomorrow. Well, actually, it is worse because dragon typing is freaking overpowered. I don't have an ice type. Thank you for dodging the drain punch. Okay, I don't even care if it's not very effective. I'm gonna go for the splintered storm shards on the Kamo. I just need to get some damage off on it. You're getting Thunder Wave right the fuck now. I should have done that from the beginning. But I just wanted to go straight up for the Psychic and just immediately put the pressure on. But I need you freaking paralyzed so you stop being able to move so damn fast and outspeed my entire damn team. Thank you for being paralyzed. Alright, I got the special D drop and I'm max... Um... Or, what? Uh... I'm full health, is what I meant to say. So I'm gonna just go for the big psychic on the Kamo'o. If the Kamo'o can get paralyzed again, or, uh. Okay, that's fine. It's gonna hurt, but paralyzed hacks, I have faith in you. Oh my god, we did it. Paralyzed hacks, you come through in the clutch again. I love this Pokemon. <sighs> Paralyzed Hacks, please don't faint. Oh my gosh. That would have freaking sucked, actually. Okay, we're gonna heal up Tenzin, because if Paralyzed Hacks goes down, I need Tenzin to come in and clean up. Hey, Paralyzed Hacks survived. The Paralyzed Hacks... I freaking love you. Thank you so much, dude. You're like... I, you're actually probably the only reason I was able to beat the Kamo'o in general. So, I'm going to just go for the Stone Edge. I should have gone for the, the Z-Move just to make sure I don't miss. I mean, this thing is Screech, and then... Oh my gosh. Special moves. Why did I do that again? If you do over half, I'm in big trouble. Thank you for not missing. Okay. Oh my gosh, man. That was stupid... I hate dragon types. They're, they're really overpowered when it comes to normal play. Because we don't have a specific Pokemon that can deal with that. I had Lissa last time. And she just obliterated with Moonblast. <sighs> we got the Dragonium Z, which doesn't matter because we don't have a dragon type move on the team. Or dragon type Pokemon. <laughs> I am in need of a desperate heal right now. I don't know what's even going to happen. You obtained Dragonium Z. Indeed I did. I don't... I, it le we, this leads directly to the altar. So... I don't think I specifically have to... Worry so much. I think... What's her name meets us here. And maybe you'll heal me up. Lilia! Our history tells the vast pony can travel was the first trial to ever be held. Did a fine job clearing it, just expected. You cleared the seven trend all the southern times, that's wonderful. You push yourself beyond your limits to become a great trainer. And she could have n oh yeah, you're not just like not freaking like a rock. Pikachu. I guess my entire team had to like go down again, but whatever. Look at you, this might just work out. No, I'm quite sure of it. <laughs> Alright, don't drag me into this whole thing. Sun flu, sun flu and the moon flu, we sound both together. Let's go, Lilia. Now you gotta wait, because I'm in this episode here. I've been recording 150, 150 minutes, uh, 110 minutes, I mean, an hour and 50 minutes. So, that's, I'm gonna end this. Thanks for this watch. I'm really enjoyed it. Appreciate it in the next episode. We'll do whatever. So, talk to you all later.